Let's get a pairing together for Stock versus Tune. Let's actually do that GG350 versus Murcielago SV. So, let's head straight to Lamborghini. Wherever they are. There they are. <laughs> I was going to say, wherever Lamborghini is. All right, Murcielago SV. We'll make sure it's stock, and then we will drive it up to the racetrack, and we will run our speed. All right, upgrades and tuning, and just make doubly, triply sure that it is stock, which indeed it is. Indeed, it is stock. All right, we are good to go, boys. So let's drive up to the racetrack, and let's see what we can do on the way. Now, I'm hoping to put down a pretty good speed when we get up there. Um, but, at the end of the day, yo, what's going on, Tommy? And, oh my god, Metabolic, thank you again for the 100,000 sparks. 11 million hype. Dude, the hype doesn't stop around here today. Wow. Alright, let's run up there. We're gonna, oh god, it's gonna make us go through the drift zones. No! I'm not even going to care about the drift zone, man. Not even going to rem- Oh, God. Ah! Not even going to remotely care about the drift zone. Less than a mile to go. In fact, I'm just going to cut this. I was going to say, it's quicker. You literally may as well cut it in that scenario. All right. Now, to make it fair, we are going to have a identical starting point for both cars. I mean, at least roughly identical. All right, I feel like a very fair starting line is the starting line, and we'll start by placing our front tires just on the edge. So now we're gonna see what we can get to the speed zone, and that is gonna be what the other car has to beat. What do you guys think it's gonna do? 210, 220, 197, 3, 2, 1, go! That was a clean launch. It was all clutch slip, that's why. Come on, come on, come on, come on! I love how the pupper spam is still going. I just need to not look over there while I'm trying to set a speed. Uh, 172 miles an hour. Which is not terrible. But it's also not great. I, I, I have to admit, it's also not great. Ah! No! Oh my god, it's literally if the controller disconnects from the... From its wired connection, the game is like, we're restarting now. We love you too. And I'm like, no! Well, now we need a stock Shelby GT350. There's Ford. Where is it? There it is, GT350R. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go and reset it and make sure it's reset. So, yeah. Let's see. Let's make sure this guy works properly. Oh God! Yikes! It was under three thousand pounds and over a thousand horsepower. It was not in a. Uh, it was not in a in a condition that would have been fair for this event. Let's say. Oh come on, you better! I was like, why are you not saving? You better. Stock GT350 GT is not a bad drift car. It could be better, but, but it's not, um, it's nothing like super crazy that I would write home about, you know? It's still almost 100,000 points in a completely stock car, which isn't bad. Oh God. Uh. No, 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 no! Yeah, part of me is just trying to throw ridiculous lines with, uh, like, with a stock steering box. And as you can see, that sometimes, that sometimes ends in, uh, not so great results. Oh, 
Okay. So, stock GT350R, not the greatest drift car in the world. Um, we'll see you, Channel One. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it so much. No, we don't want to go left. And stop. All right. And go. Get those guesses out there. 157. I definitely don't think it's going to be as fast as the, um, the Murcielago SV with like a 174 or something like that. But I do think it will be fairly quick. Coffee, thank you for the follow. And across the line. Okay, so 162. 162 is not too shabby. Oh, you were off by 11, uh, 11 miles an hour. I almost had horsepower for some odd reason. I don't know why. They should have put a garage next to the track. Honestly, that would have been a really good idea. That would have been a really good move. So let me see what PI that um, Mercy SV was. Mercy SV was S184. No. These are not the same. Ouch. All right. Well, I guess we're going to go ahead and just throw some build. Like, we're going to throw a build at this thing then. I'm literally just going to throw some, like, I'm just going to throw some whistly spooly boys on the thing and then call it a day probably and go from there because, yeah, um, our PI, it was, they were like, oh yeah, don't worry about it. We already got that covered. I was like, yeah, but that doesn't help me. <laughs> that doesn't help what we're doing here. Let me get it lowered so it looks a little bit better. Really, there's very little, if anything, to do to it. There really is, like, very little to do to it. And I don't know. I mean... Let's see. JG Games, what kind of vehicle do you have in real life? I have a BMW E46 M3 and a Honda S2000. So, let's see. All we did... Remember, we're going for like a 174-ish. So, all we did was twin turbos, race exhaust, race intake, and race flywheel. We lowered it, and that's about... That's about it. That's literally about it. Well, here we go. Test of the brakes. Oh, yeah. Holy crap, they're good. On the line. All right. Now, before we... Oh, are you serious? Oh, you better not. Okay, I was like, what the heck? Let's see. We got some predictions. What are our predictions for speed, people? What do we think it's going to run? Do, you think we, do we think it's going to beat that mid-170s of the Murcielago? Everybody's saying, like, 175, 175, 176. Somebody said 200. I feel like that's a little, a little excessive. And go. Well, not necessarily excessive in a bad way, but, like, I think that's a little bit of an overestimation. But we'll find out. Almost there, come on. Last bit. Come on, stay away from the apron. Ah! 179 miles an hour, we beat the Lamborghini. The GT350R beat the Lamborghini. Well, hey, I mean, that was actually a really good suggestion. I kinda like doing them here. Um, let's see. There's alien plants you didn't take notice of. Yeah, that's because we were doing this. 
If I was just free roaming, I would have totally gone after him. But I'll actually be right back, all right, guys? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go um, get a couple of things ready for the rest of the stream, and then I will be right back, all right? So if, if you guys want to chill for, like, two, three minutes, you'll see, my, uh, you'll see me back here within that period of time. So I'll be right back. Hang around, chill out, and we'll be kicking back off in just a couple minutes.